got lots of tips, lots and lots of tips. Like, never give up. Think positively. Um, try as hard as you can to, to get an internship uh, somewhere. I mean, those are some kind of practical things. Um, I think there are a lot of uh, um, uh, very um, talented young designers that are going, you know what, I'm just going to go out there and do something myself. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to collaborate with some like-minded young people. We're going to go and find an opportunity. Uh, we're going to uh, uh, build a pop-up studio somewhere on a high street in a store that's not used, and we're just going to figure it out for ourselves. So I think one of the great things possibly about um, uh, design these days, if I can say that, is uh, with the, the technology that's available to us, you don't need huge facilities you don't even need huge funding, arguably. You can make a difference, uh, um, I'd say, I wouldn't say very easily, but you can make a difference on your own. Um, and I think that's, uh, you know, arguably, uh, it's, it's, like, um, say, it's like musicians these days, they don't need record companies. So service design challenges don't necessarily need service design consultancies. If with a different mindset, thinking about the the user, uh, thinking positively, trying to understand the challenges in a kind of holistic kind of way. These are all things that, uh, that, that we can we can do straight out of college as a as a young designer. Yeah. We can yeah. we can we can do that. So I'll summarize as go out and make a difference. There we go. Perfect. <laughs>